A new AI system that prevents slips, trips and falls at workplaces will be rolled out to at least 50 companies this year. The Manpower Ministry is urging firms to adopt such technology. Such accidents have caused the most workplace injuries in the last five years. No Min Min reports. Dealing with rubbish is its business. Bits and pieces are scattered all around at this recycling plant almost every day. And for workers who aren't careful, danger could be lurking around the corner. But this firm has put in a system that includes video analytics and giving out these to prevent more slips, trips and falls, or STFs. Each worker gets a wearable device like this, and when it detects a slip, the supervisor gets a real-time alert which allows him or her to act on it immediately. The devices pick out these accidents with GPS technology and an AI system which monitors hand gestures. So far, it's been 97% accurate, even for near-miss accidents or minor slips which aren't often reported. Previously, uh, they will actually rely more on information from the staff itself. So sometimes, end of the day or end of the week, our crew uh, might miss out or might forget the incident. Whereas with this system, uh, we lock on the incident immediately. So from the back end, our plant manager or safety team, they be able to do their analysis. For one, accident-prone areas are identified more quickly for changes to be made. We receive a lot of recyclables that might uh, leak water. Okay, so previously, uh, our process is that whenever there's uh, unloading, okay, uh, cleaner will actually go there and segregate. So what, one of the key things now that after unloading happen, they will not immediately uh, segregate, but they will actually do a bit of housekeeping. It costs about $450 a month to equip its 30 workers with the device. So far, 10 companies have ordered the product ahead of its launch next month. Its makers say this includes those in the construction, manufacturing, maritime and logistics sector. More places could soon use it as well. So we are also building other sensors into the variable like heart rate uh, monitoring and fatigue and exertion. When we are overworked, uh, even at our office jobs, we tend to make mistakes. So when workers are overworked, they may not be as attentive and accidents may happen. Last year, the firm worked with the government to test bid this solution with industry players in a bid to come up with ways to reduce STFs. Such accidents have been the leading cause of major injuries at workplaces for the past five years.